as you guys per requested a what's in your purse tag I am going to do that for you guys today um, it's going to be this very cute purse that I got for my sister for Christmas and she got it from the limited it was a Christmas gift and I loved it I got it early so I was able to actually take this on vacation with me and I just love it and it's a crossbody crossbodies are actually very comfortable when you're on vacation because then you don't have to worry about having it on your shoulders it's pretty spacious and it is faux patent leather I was never ever a fan of patent leather until this came along and it is my favorite color it's taupe on top of gold which is one of my favorite color combinations together and I absolutely love it and it's got a tassel which I absolutely loved most about this purse was the tassel it really brought out the look Let's see what I have in here it's been a while since I've actually emptied it out or used it because on the, when I'm back at home I don't use my purse I actually just bring like a wristlet I'll just bring my license and debit card and then whatever else I need and when you open it up it actually has buckle it up right here with the two buckles you have to actually squeeze it and then snap it in when you snap it in it sticks and then when you unsnap it it opens up like this and then you have this tassel right here we can unzip which is awesome because this has a lot of compartments and you can stick a lot of stuff in here now this one nada there's nothing in here but when you get to this point, you have lots of stuff and junk in here. And I have a lot of paper in here. Oh, I still have my virtually bare itinerary list here from um, going back home. My family lives in Wisconsin, Midwest. Woo woo. Yes, for cheese heads. Yes, yes, yes. I went back during the holidays to visit and it was amazing. I miss my family so much, but. I'm going to toss this out because I don't need it anymore. I have an empty stride gum wrap, which should be in the garbage. I just love collecting paper. Oh, and look what I have. I have a medical care center leave note, absence note. If you guys are wondering what this is, I actually had a really, really bad skin or whatever, skin allergic reaction on Wednesday. And if you guys follow me on Instagram or my Facebook page, I posted up. A before and after picture of when I had the hives and two hours later after I took the medication and let me just tell you guys it was the most scariest moment of my entire life I have never ever experienced anything that scary ever before and I'm so thankful that it's finally gone it was pretty bad and I I the sad thing is I don't know how I got the reaction I don't know what it was I'm assuming that I got it from applying this new body butter that I got from Bath and Body Works but um, that is staying away I'm not touching it it is cashmere if you guys are wondering and because it gave me a reaction I'm so sad but I'm staying away from Bath and Body Works now so that was my little spiel I know it's a little off topic but CBS receipt I love shopping there for coupon days on Sundays I have my baggage claims sticker check whatever it is oh my god I need to toss that out it's been like two weeks now oh and this is cool so during vacation my father-in-law uh, wrote down pressure points for me because girls if you guys want to know and guys if you don't fast forward if not whatever it's life um, I suffer from very very bad menstrual cycle cramps and even when I take medication it'll work for hours and then it'll stop and I just hate to have to always take medication every four to six hours and I don't like that I'm more of a natural healer it has a book of pressure points for certain medical problems I guess and I guess mine is a medical problem and um, he actually drew the body parts which they look really really cute um, I know I know and um, he actually drew the pressure points so it actually shows you the pressure points for instance this one's probably easier just look and see and understand but this is the face and on top of the head is the pressure point right here and you actually just press down on that point during or prior or after your cycle six pressure points for mental cramps if you want to know comment message I'll tell ya no secrets this is a Nike card my husband has yet to use and I know I'm talking too much, but this is actually a very boring video because I don't have any makeup or anything fun in here. So 
my coach wristlet. I actually brought it with me because I thought we were going to go out. Liz Claiborne is like my favorite brand in terms of wallets. I'm so pissed off at TJ Maxx. Or maybe it's just my TJ Maxx that I go to. They no longer carry Liz Claiborne. And I'm so mad. Liz Claiborne was so affordable and her selections were amazing. From TJ Maxx a while or way back. It's got the gold, which I love the gold on top of taupe. And my wallet just goes like this. Very simple cards. A very cute picture of my husband and I. We've been together for seven years. Seven years, wow. So long, can't believe it. And then just rewards cards and credit cards that I may or may not use anymore. And I don't carry cash, so that's that. Um, of course I have to carry my Telenol Extra Strength. You never know what's gonna happen. My terms, I carry it because of my cramps, so I need that with me. Um, oh, I have my necklace here. Now this necklace was commented like so much. I freaking hate this necklace. Um, just the way it lays on my neck, I freaking hate it, and I wasted 10 bucks on it. So, Forever 21, the quality, I tell you. Um, next is the soft matte lip cream that I actually had in my purse. Then I have my Sephora's Duo Mirror, I guess is what you call it, a mirror. And this actually comes really handy when, um, oh, this is an up-close and a distant one. I didn't know that, but... That's that. In the back here, it's more easy access, so I tend to just throw everything in there. And it seems like it's a lot of coupons and receipts. I coupon, so I tend to just throw coupons in here and who knows what I have. That's pretty much it, guys. This is what I have in my purse. Really, really boring, but um, you guys asked for it. So, anywho, guys, as always, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye!